So this is the way you can set up goal conversions uh, for public relations uh, projects or any kind of projects in Google Analytics. For this purpose, we're going to use the Payne Publishing uh, site and we're going to go to Admin and then we're going to go over here to Goals. And we already have set up a number of goals, become a subscriber, buy a product, complete an interaction. You can see all of these. These are all different goals that we've already had. Um, so but for purposes of this, we're going to create a new one. And uh, we can either select a template um, that actually will set it all up for you. But since it's a little bit different, uh, we're going to show you how to do it yourself. So what we're going to do is we're going to go um, to uh, custom and then we're gonna say call this purchase um, measurement measurement 101 okay and what we're gonna do is we're gonna call this uh, a destination and I'm gonna show you the uh, the URL this is the URL I want people to go to and we're gonna put a value on it um, now, the way we calculate this is, is the value of the product is $101. Uh, we actually know that for every 20 people who click on this, one person might buy. So, 1 20th of 101 um, is 5. So, we're going to put a value on it as $5. And then we're going to ask it to verify this goal. And as you can see, there have been zero conversion rates. but. Uh, we could try a different setup or we could just accept that not a whole lot of people have done that in the last few days. Uh, so we're going to save that one. Okay. And then um, we're going to go in here and um, modify one that was already here. So um, becoming a subscriber, for example. Now, a subscriber to our newsletter, um, uh, we use the template. For making a payment and so that's completed an online payment um, and what you'll see is that it um, you can define it in terms of goal details and this is thank you for subscribing so what that means is I know that somebody's actually purchased something when they um, sign up for a subscription and since the subscription is $9.99 a month uh, we've got the value in there of $9.99 and we validate that um, and uh, we'll verify that um, and again there's I'm trying to show you one that actually has a verification so that might be too high a level um, for much I mean we know that that's a fairly good value um, in this case, if I um, want somebody to, if I, if one of the goals is having people download my speeches, because that's a way of engaging. It's a fairly low level of engagement. Um, and so what we do is we set that up as a template to view more. So it views products or service details, as you can see. Um, and we've called it download speech. And again, it's a destination. Uh, and the details of it are, here's where you can actually download those speeches. Uh, we put a value on there of $5 just because um, a lot of people who download my speeches do come back and buy something. Um, you might want to make it more scientific than that, but um, for us it basically tells us when people are interested in that particular goal. And we're going to save that. So these are all of our goals. Now we can go back and look at the reporting of those goals. Uh, and as you can see, go to this, now we go down here and we go into conversions. And under conversions you have goals and we have an overview of all of the goals, right? So that just tells us how many goals were completed. Um, and then it'll break that out by the specific URL. So uh, speeches and presentations, we know that seven people have done that, so that's seven times five that we just set up, that's 35. Uh, measurement 101 course in a box, we said that, uh, two people have gone there uh, and actually purchased that. Uh, so that is a very quick tutorial on how to set 
up goals and conversions in Google Analytics.